So, welcome. I'm going to play the $100,000 pyramid on the Commodore 64. It's from Box Office Software. The box has a 1987 copyright, but you may have noticed on the loading screens, it's 1988. I believe that's the year of release. I did edit down the loading screens, even though it's still loading right now, but it's almost set. So this is a game show, of course, in the 80s. I believe it began in the 70s. It's had a few different names basically just the dollar amounts changing and it is still around the host in this year would have been Dick Clark so this game is clearly meant for multiplayer and I will be playing solo Just let you see the credits I guess program by Richard Hansen so you can actually play up to four players if you're familiar with the TV show, it's teams of two. So one player wouldn't be looking at the screen. You just have to give clues to guess words. That's basically it. Unfortunately, when you play with the computer, you're the one giving the clues through most of the game. But in the bonus round, it's the opposite. What you're going to hear most is my, my typing. I'm, it's really loud, and, and this is a lot of typing, this game. That's all it is. I keep switching between different ways of recording the audio in my videos for the Let's Play. For the, the toy videos, it's different because I'm standing in the room, but when I'm at my computer, which is what I'm doing... I either use a microphone like I'm using now at a distance or a headset, but the headset picks up too many little mouth noises even when hydrated. I I still think it is annoying, so I'm trying with a distant microphone for this one. But it's going to um pick up a lot of typing noise, maybe some other noises, but in particular, this game is quiet, so you really don't have too much to hear. There's just a few sound effects when you get things right. I'm going to skip that one. <laughs> not, not coming up with anything. Oh, well, here's another holiday. You just got to get the clues of the computer as pre-programmed into it. You just got to match one of a few clues. So you can, on the TV show you can pass clues, but there's a time limit. Now, I passed on this one, but it comes back because there's no time limit. I can just completely skip, which I'm going to do often probably, just because I want to keep this video moving pretty quick, because there's, I know it's boring <laughs> to watch. But, see, this one again, it's a different category, but it's the same word. The clues are different. Uh. What I'm trying to do is play all the game show games I have on Commodore. So regardless of how bad the game might be, or how bad it is to record, I'll still, um, still record them anyway. I mean... I don't know how many videos exist for this game, I didn't even check, but it's not the best game to record. Hmm. I don't even know what to say. I'll pass. 
past that one. <laughs> yeah, it's sore. Uh, maybe an enter or two words. Sometimes I type them all as one and it seemed okay. Skip the rest of those. Okay, the untouchables. There's also a 7-Eleven that'll pop up. It's not the uh, convenience store. <laughs> it's get all seven right, you get $1,100 bonus. Clues. I guess I need to pluralize? Yeah, yeah, I needed an S on the end. Yeah, typing on this keyboard, not always easy. certain number, I'm not sure how many clues total to get to the bonus. Of course, I'm playing all the categories because I'm playing one player, but if it's another, if there's a second player, you'd be you know, alternating. I think, I haven't seen the, the game show in quite some time. I don't know. <laughs> uh. yeah. I'm having a hard time with these. Oh well, I did bad. I'm just gonna skip the rest of those. Yes, I did not get it. You gotta wait some, a bit until you can press a key to get out of there. Alright. Hopefully make the bonus round off these. I don't know if they allow... Oh, you can't do spaces. Anyway, let me just end this one. Okay, so here, clues are just gonna speed by me, and I gotta guess what it is. Let's see 
hear that noise, that's a disk drive loading. Alright. Things in a... Things said by... Uh, <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm in luck. Um. Yeah, I see that one. Only two clues. Oh, that's too bad. I had a lot of time, too. Well, it was one more round, at least. So if you want to see more, here we go again. <laughs> All right, Let's see, I can't go quicker. Yeah, I've played a little bit before and I'm getting repeat categories. That did not take long. Yeah, I couldn't find a clue for him last time. Oh, I wrong. I had no idea what to guess there either. I think all of these, this whole board is a duplicate. And yeah, I couldn't get Monk last time either. I could not get a lot of these. I, I, I don't think I could get Monument, which I can understand. I guess so many things. I'll skip the rest of those. Actually, I don't think I've seen this category before. The other clues weren't better. Hmm, what's another name for a blimp? Ship worked. Got him all.
to the, the music, but... Category already has piano in it, so they don't, they don't know. They don't know what they want. <laughs> yeah, I don't know a good clue for him. Dance isn't good. Well, I'll skip the rest of those. I hope you need to get 25 or 30 to reach the uh, bonus. I don't know why I typed the color, that made no sense. Game. bonus round and I think that will mark the end. I mean, how long could this go? I didn't play a full game yet. I don't think. Well, actually, the game ended after two bonus rounds last time, but I failed both of them. I don't know if that matters. Cement floor in a furnace. I don't. I'm really confused. Well, it then makes sense. I think it will. Yeah, these are hard. I, <laughs> yeah, we have the time counting down. I, I don't know. I just can't think fast enough on some of them. I think that's the end. You did not win the bonus round. But yeah, I guess, you know, you're just trying to win the 100,000. And he is sorry, but I lost. Okay, so hope you enjoyed listening to my typing, because <laughs> I'm sure it picked up a lot of that. Thanks for watching.